So in 2 Nephi chapter 19, verses 6 and 7, there's this famous verse from Isaiah um, that says, For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. Of the increase of government and peace, there is no end upon the throne of David and upon his kingdom to order it and to establish it with judgment and with justice from henceforth forever, even forever. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform this. And this is a very similar to the way it's written in the book of Isaiah in chapter 9, verses 6 and 7. And what's and this verse was made famous, of course, by Handel Messiah's favorite song, the For unto us a child is born. Anyways, what stuck out to me this time I read it is that last phrase in verse seven: "The zeal of the Lord of Hosts will perform this." The Messiah's rule, Christ's rule is not a military takeover and it's not caused through political machinations, it's zeal. Zeal is defined as a great passion or enthusiasm in the pursuit of a cause or objective. I believe that people being zealous in pursuit of Christ's teachings, this is what will prepare the world for him to become the ruler of the world. Um, and that's also why one of his titles is counselor in verse six. We won't have his law forced on us. We'll follow his teachings like someone might follow a trusted counselor. Christ has counseled us to be humble, to be prayerful, to forgive, to turn to God when we make mistakes or need comfort, to repent. And if we want to prepare the world for the rule of Christ, we need to be zealous about humility, zealous about forgiveness, zealous about charity, and about changing our hearts to love God and to love our fellow human beings. And that that's what's going to cause bring about Christ's rule over the world is people being zealous for his teachings and and viewing him letting him rule over us now um, even though he's not physically um, over, not physically here letting him rule over us by following his teachings zealously